Hello friends, if you use Eagle software, then sometime you may thought to put your personal customized logo on the PCB. In this video, we will make a library containing customized personal brand logo. So whenever I will make a new PCB, I will be able to put my logo on it easily. Let's see how we can make the library which have my logo. Here it is I am having an image of the logo. It's a JPEG file and I am going to open it with Windows Paint software. Here you can see the image, it's a big and good quality image. Now I am going to convert this image in the monochrome image. In menu, file, I will go to save as, BMP. I am going to save this image as BMP pictures. I will choose the option monochrome bitmap in the save as type pull down menu. So the image will become in only two colors are black and white. I will save in BMP. Press OK. Here you can see the image is converted into monochrome. You can see, here it is my logo. Now, I will make an eagle library having this logo. So I will be able to put this logo on my PCB design every time very easily. Now we will go to Eagle application. Here it is, and in menu new, library. First we will make a symbol. We will write the name of the symbol is logo underscore brainstorm. I know that my image is 2000 pixel in height and it will be about 5 centimeter. So I will put the name height 5 cm. Press OK, then create, click on yes. I am not having anything to create in symbol. In description, we will again write logo, underscore, brainstorm, underscore, h, underscore 5 centimeter I will copy it so I will be able to use it again now I am going to do nothing in this window now save this library as logo brainstorm. Press enter. I have made symbol first. Now I will make a package. Keep the name as I have copied and press OK. It is not available. To create, click on yes. Now, I will bring the logo image and that is the monochrome bitmap image I have created earlier. Now I will give a command for that. The command is run, import, dash, bmp, dot, ulp. That is the command. and a window is opened. Press OK. Now it is asking for the file location. I will copy the file location path and put it there. Press open. Select image and press OK. Now it is asking for the color and there is only two. I will select black Press OK. 
Now here it is some options are there. It is showing that the selected image is having high 2000 pixels and the width is 1515 pixels. It is asking for the scaling factor. I will keep one so the height of the logo will be about 5 cm. Now, in which layer I want to keep this logo is to be defined there. Default is layer number 200 but I will choose 201 for my logo. Now click on OK. Some processing is start now. Then click on run script. Here you can see the logo is there. I am able to see an unwanted line in the bottom. Over there. I will delete the line since it is just useless and not looking good. Now here it is my final logo. I am going to put the description. And then press OK. There I created the package and now I will save it. Now, I will make the device. I will again put the name and press OK. It is asking to create the new device. Click on Yes. Here it is, and then I will click on New. We will see the already created package there. I will select and bring this package over there. Then I will put the description over there. And click OK. Then I will click on the save. And it is saved now. We can make the logo in the different sizes so further I am going to make in another logo of different size in the same library. Whenever I will need to put different size logo like 5 cm, 2 cm, 1 cm etc. I will be able to select and put the desired size logo on the PCB as per the space available on PCB. Now I am making another logo of 1.25 cm in height. So I will again make the symbol first. I will put the name and say the height is 1.25 cm. This time I am making the logo of 1 fourth in the height of the previous logo. It is asking for new. I will select yes. I am not going to do anything there, only I will put the description. And in description, I will write the height 1.25 cm. I am copying it to use the same string again. So press Ctrl C. I will do nothing else over there and save it. Now I will make a new package. And give it a name. It is height 1.25 cm. It is asking for create a new one. Click on OK. Now again I am to run the command. So give the command run, import, dash, bmp, dot, ulp press enter. Then click on OK. Now here it is the logo bmp image. Check mark the black, and now click the OK button. Here it is the image pixel size. Now we want to make it 1.25 cm height, it is 1 fourth of the 5 cm so I will put 0.25 as the scaling factor. I will select the layer 201. Click the OK button. Now some process is going on.
click on run script. Now here it is, you can see the logo. Again I will remove an unwanted string in the bottom left corner of the logo. I will just delete the string. Now I will save the library. I will put the description string. Paste, as it was copied and click OK. Then thereafter I will make a new device. I will paste the name. Click OK. Then it asks for create new and I click OK. Now we have to bring the package there. So select the newly created and click OK. Now in the description put the copied string. And press OK. And then save it. And finally it is done. Now in my library. I am having the logo in the two different sizes one is 5 cm in height and another one is 1.25 cm in height. Now I will close this. Now we will try to use my own created library, which is having my customized logo in it. So, we will make a new project. We will create a schematic in the project. Just now I am not putting anything in it. I will include the library which I have recently created. Select the logo underscore brainstorm. Now, I will open the board. Here it is, now I will add the logo there. So click on the device. Then find the included library that is Logo Brainstorm. Here it is, when we click on it we can see two different logo are there select first and click OK. Here we get the logo, and put it where you need to put on PCB. Now, if we want we can put the smaller one also. Like this. Now, you see we have made the logo in two different size and put it on the PCB. So if we design some circuit like we put some component. Like for demonstration something randomly. A few component like this. Then we will go in the PCB layout. Put the component on the PCB. And as well as we are having logo on the PCB with the components. Hope you like this video. If yes, please click on thumbs up, and subscribe the channel for the future videos. Click on the bell icon. Thanks for watching the video.